What I'm guessing is that a lot of people don't think this would work because they're, you're only going to get sunlight 40% of the time and so, uh, or something like that. And so when you have a ton of these, they're going to be blocking um, the sun. But that's one of the reasons why I wanted this to be movable. But maybe the reason it's a good idea, no matter what, is because the distances are shorter and so you can generate more heat I mean I think it's obvious that you would be able to generate more heat when you're generating heat which means you could turn a larger turbine and generate more electricity during those hours and if we have batteries say that they're potassium sodium batteries um, or whatever then um, what would really matter is the amount of electricity we generate during specific times um, and I, I don't know what that, I don't know necessarily know if that's the solution for desalinating water though, because we can only desalinate water during certain hours. But um, that doesn't mean that we can't still have solar ovens and stuff like that. Um, but if we're blocking the sun, then can you have a solar oven there? I don't know, dude. I don't know if there's a solution to the energy crisis. That's the thing. I think that. Um, I think I've had my life saved more than once, probably not because I'm going to solve the energy crisis, but it's probably because I'm part of the people that want to survive no matter what. I don't know, dude. Solving difficult science problems is difficult, especially when you're not a scientist, and I'm not a scientist. I think we need to try, though.